the cry of a sparrow was really well done um I think you do a really great job of showcasing the relationship and dynamic of this mother and son in a way that I wasn't expecting and seeing, um, you know, who takes on that leadership role and who like solves the conflict. Uh, it, it was done in a way that I wasn't expecting. Um, and it added so much to their relationship and seeing how everything played out. Um, I'm going to commend these two actors for really developing uh, a good relationship on screen I think it was uh, believable and and really helped further the story along and overall it was shot very well I think it was shot very well I think the relationship was believable I think it was an interesting um, story to tell and just overall very very well done The Cry of the Sparrow is immediately engaging you know opening a terrific use of light sound framing um, which continues through the whole thing. It is, it is gorgeous and so well designed as well. That sounds fantastic. Um, you know, and the central mother-child relationship is terrific. It's done in a very moving way. Um, the way that it handles like this mother dealing with some very adult, quite you know, it's kind of a horrifying situation, um, trying to shield that from her, from her child, you know, from from the horror of it, is really well handled. Uh, really well handled and really affecting. Um, I love the use of like stories and, and, and memories and stuff to try and take these kids' mind off things and take them to somewhere nicer. That that came through really well. That worked really well. Um, and then you know when you get to the end and you have the rug pulled right out from under you and you realise that this wasn't at all what you thought it was, but at the same time it makes total sense. Is 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 brilliant, you know, and it really kind of hammers home themes in a really interesting and unique unique way that I kind of haven't really seen before. It's really impactful and I like the cry of a sparrow. It was very emotionally resonant. You talk about hitting you in the feels, Pixar type beat. Yeah, yeah, it was very effective on that. Getting me invested, mother son. Heartstrings is what it pulled on. Um, it was also reminding me kind of like Jojo Rabbit, but less funny. Um, in a good way, in all the best ways. In that, in that, like tragic, heartbreaking you know, emotional, um, I thought the acting, you know, not e I was going to say he was great for a child, but not even just for a child, just a great actor, period, uh, is what bro was, both, both of them, his mother and his son, they were great, um, ready for Hollywood, ready to be a star, um, also great cinematography, all around, just really entertaining, really gripping, and emotionally resonant, um, good job. The Cry of a Sparrow was such an incredibly beautiful film. Um, the relationship between the mother and son was so believable, so real, so well done. Um, I also really want to commend the cinematography. Some of those shots were so beautiful. I keep thinking of the the like slow mo moments um, where you just see the the wind slightly, you know going through his hair, the close-up of the little boat that he made on the water. Just these little moments that are just so artistic and beautiful and intentional. And I just felt like the whole piece had this really cinematic quality to it um, that really made it something special to watch. Um, I think this was wonderful filmmaking, especially that opening scene was so intense um, and really grabs you right from the start. And just the performances overall, like, this was a great film. Wonderful job. Cry of a Sparrow does an amazing job of building a very vivid and realistic world um, and making it really poignant with the flashbacks and the characters' experiences. And it, it sets it up for a really satisfying ending in terms of the reveal. I would love to know the characters' backstories. It's a really fascinating and interesting story that's portrayed. And the artistic license um, with some of the themes and symbolism were really, really great. The Cry of a Sparrow. This starts out in such beautiful cinematography fantastic lighting what they did up in that room and you know in the first 20 seconds 
what's going on in this film. It kind of drops you on this moving train and you're right there along for the ride and it keeps you glued there to see what's going to happen. And I think what the filmmakers did with it was really, really smart because that twist, not expecting, not expecting that twist at the end, but it was such a beautiful relationship. I loved the flashbacks and the actors were absolutely brilliant. The rapport that they had between each other was very believable. I thought that they were, you know, mother and son. Everything about this was so very cool. It was a great film. So really interesting premise, you know, uh, it really subverted your expectations because, uh, you know, I was expecting the, the mother to kind of save the day, but it ends up being that the little boy has figured everything out and ends up showing her the way. And, uh, you know, it has a nice ending. You expect it to kind of have a, you know, you're expecting trouble um, at the end, but things uh, get resolved in a very interesting way with a, a very interesting twist. So, yeah, so it was nicely written, nicely directed, nicely edited. The actors did a great job, you know, um, the, the, the mother and the son and everybody that appeared on screen did a, did a really nice job. So interesting premise here. I'd be, um, you know, I'd be interested to see it get fleshed out a little more, um, you know, maybe in a, in a little bit of a longer form piece, but uh, yeah, this is really nice. So congratulations. I hope it gets out there and gets seen. Simply put, a very beautiful film. Um, it was superbly poetic, but also felt uh, very grounded and had this absolute, like, just naturalistic, conversational style, while also feeling really poetic. Uh, very, very um, amazing sort of line to toe, really. Uh, remarkable performances from both of our leads. I thought they both, in equal parts, carried uh, the story really well. Um, and there was just a great contrast of shots between the indoor and the outdoor and that sort of dynamic, that interplay between the shots uh, worked really well, had a really strong effect. Overall, just a really well done film and I thoroughly enjoyed it.